What's up, Taurus? Welcome to Pink Scorpion Intuitive Readings. It's your girl, Scorpion Queen. And I'm here to pour some general energy for you to, uh, let me see, what should be such? How are you feeling towards your partner? General energy. So please keep in mind that this reading may or may not resonate with you. So take what resonates and leave the rest. If it don't fit, don't force it. Just relax and let it go. Okay. So I'm going to pull up, um, four cards for you, Taurus. We'll discuss it. And then I'll pull, pull four cards for your partner. Okay. And we'll discuss it. Okay. Holy Spirit and Holy Angels, show me the energy surrounding Taurus towards their partner. What is the energy of Taurus towards their partner? Show me the energy of Taurus towards their partner. Energy Taurus partner. Taurus partner. Wow, this the same card that came out first for uh Aries. You daydream about something. So your overall energy towards this person is you're you're daydreaming about them. You are um, sensitive. You're a simple to love person. Or this is how you feel about them. You watch them. But you don't say nothing. Some things you you may uh, look at them sideways, like what the fuck did he just say, or what did what did he just do to where sometimes it make your hair stand up on your head. Um, I see some of you out there thinking and daydreaming about this person. I gotta pull some clarifier cards. Maybe you haven't um, been intimate with this person in a while and you sleep a lot. Um, why is the repose here for Taurus concerning their partner? Why is repose here? There's cobwebs around. Like you're laying, you're, you could be laying next to your partner. Um, Dreaming about them. Um, or if you're not with this person, you're at home. Dreaming about them and you have cobwebs. Because you haven't been touched in a while. Okay, give me more. Spirit is saying you need to take the lead and get out there and shine. Instead of laying around daydreaming about this person, you need to get out there and show what it is that you do. Take the lead in your life, Taurus. Give me more for grace. Why is grace here? Why is grace here? Maybe some of your names is grace. Someone likes the color blue, or some of you um, may need to you to speak up about something instead of laying there, you know, just 
dreaming about it, you need to take the lead and speak up in this situation. But you're sensitive, or this person is sensitive. And you're trying to figure out a, 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 to simplify a way to speak to them about something. Love is waiting for you. And it's like you've been putting in a dedicated effort to this person or this relationship, this person you're thinking about. And you just, you know, you've been putting so much effort in a relationship to you wasn't taking the lead in your life, Taurus. But love is waiting. It's waiting. And we see that you put the dedicated effort in. We need you to take the lead and shine in your life. Instead of snooping your life away. Take, take pride in your life. Be the leader, take lead in your own life and shine like you're supposed to. So don't, whatever it is that you know you're supposed to be doing, do it. Don't hold back. Okay. Any more on a dedicated effort? Any more on a dedicated effort? Seek. Choose your battles. So you feel like you're, um, you could be dealing with this person and you feel small to them. You see how this person has three big faces, three big heads around them. You could be feeling small compared to all of these people or you have to fight a battle with all of these people. But I see you standing up, even though they're bigger than you, you're standing up strong towards them. You're taking the lead. And you have spirit behind you. Okay, give me, um, Show me the energy of Taurus partner, directed towards part Tor, directed towards Taurus. That's the energy of Taurus partner, directed towards Taurus. They're waiting on divine timing. Now, if you look at this card, you see the sun and the moon. Okay, you see the, the, the blue, the darkness and the light. The moon represents um, sadness, grief. And the sun represents enlightenment. So something is coming to the light. Something is coming to the light. Um, Something that was hidden is coming to the light. I put it that way, but it's coming in di in divine timing. So don't worry about it, Taurus. Just choose your battles wisely, and if you have to, um, what is it that Taurus needs to seek? What is it Taurus needs to seek? What is it that Taurus needs to seek? This is pretty. I don't know what that word is, but I don't pay attention. What it looks like to me. <clears throat> You're in a fall season. Like you like the season fall. 
You like purple flowers. You like wearing chains around your neck that, that's like, uh, could be beaded chains. Give me more spirit. Give me more spirit for the divine timing. More for the divine timing. These are some new cards, so they're kind of big. Seek is out here twice. So you need to seek something. It has to do with knowledge. Something that has you, you know, in the darkness. You need to seek spiritual advice from someone. Um, I see you trying to follow the light and you have some wisdom. You got an owl on your shoulder. So it's someone close to you that uh, could be an older person. Um, that's very wise. And even though you feel that this person is, is letting you walk alone, they're there right on your shoulder. Okay. They're with you just watching you seek. Or this owl could represent, um, somebody watching you. You could know someone is watching you. They could watch you sleep. Give me more spirit. Give me more energy for Taurus. More energy for Taurus. What did I just say? Wisdom. Wisdom. And see the owl right here on her shoulder? That's also wisdom. So maybe you're making a wise decision. Whoever this person is, if this is a love interest, he's, he's a bit older than you. This person has a lot of experiences under his robe. This parent, this person has family. This person knows how to take care of home. This person loves animals. This person may be a little slow because of their age. Or maybe they're just slow because they're wisdom. They could have gray hair, but not really be old. This could be the person who has something hidden. This person also could love the color blue. This person can also be a Leo or a, a fire sign. This person is so wise that it's magical. It's like you've seen this person do things you could have seen this this old man no remedies how to uh you've seen him help heal some sick animals maybe he owns a farm or something and he knows how to take care of his animals. Oh, spirit. He knows how to take care of horses. If horses get sick, he knows what to do. He knows when an a animal is giving birth, what to do. This man is like Noah of Noah's Ark. <laughs> He's that wise. 
okay? And he wants you to seek wisdom too. Okay. Give me more for Taurus. You may feel like a child when this comes to this person. Yeah, this person is older than you, Taurus. They're older than you. Um, they want to marry you. This person is strong. It's a possible Leo. Because here's the lion out here twice. If he's not a Leo, this person is, has strength and they're strong. And they show courage. This person shows you... Uh, shows you a lot of adoration. They adore you. Um, maybe this person is 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 take trying to take the lead in your life. Um, by this person being older than you, they they have put you on a sexual ex escapade to where when you're intimate with them, you're 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 drained, you're sleepy. And this is why you wasn't shining because this older man has done things to you that no one else has. And he's very wise. And you love him. And either he wants to marry you, but you want to or you want to marry him. But it all comes in divine timing. Now you see the light there, you see the sun. You see that the, the lion represents strength. It represents a um, Leo. You see the flowers there. The sun represents enlightenment. Maybe this man is going to come tell you something. Here's the moon right here. Maybe he's going to tell you something to enlighten you about some lies or something he's been telling you. It's, he's going to tell you the truth because he wants to marry you now. So all of this, you know, this is in the past. And now he wants to marry you. And it looks like the spirit is with it. I see the dolphins. I see the beautiful flowers. It's going to be something beautiful with this Leo. Whoever this Leo is, Taurus, you become enlightened about the situation. Okay. About this wise man who sticks to you. He's all in your head all the time. Yeah, this person, this person, <laughs> when you have sex with them, they take you to the moon. You see the stars. <laughs> Because this man is older and he's experienced, so he knows what it takes and knows what to do to satisfy a, a, a Okay, okay. So this this older man, Taurus, this older man is if he's not if if he's not the one who's who's uh like sexually putting you to sleep he's teaching someone to or someone feels um because you see this this old man the older man here you see the girl on the horse you may ride a motorcycle. Okay, you see the, the young man talking to the old man? So this this old man could be giving this young person, this could be where the wisdom comes in. You see the shoulder, the bird on the shoulder? Okay, see this old man and this young man? Now the, the, the owl also represents oldest. So this could be you if you're a male, Taurus. You have an older man telling you um, what to say to this this female here. 
Okay, that's for some of y'all. Also, this older man is telling this young man how to support this woman, how to make her feel the fire. Yeah. This older man is telling this young man how to eat your pussy, how to fuck you good, how, how to do everything. Okay? He's teaching him. Maybe his father or his uncle telling him, you know, how they tell the, how the, the fathers do and tell their kids, their kids what to do. If it's not a father figure, it's an older uncle or someone that's telling this boy what to do, telling this young man what to do. Okay. He's telling them to take you out to like a, a secluded beach, a lake somewhere where no one's around and for well, some of y'all be careful because if you're out there having sex, somebody going to ride by in a boat and it ain't one person. Some people going to ride by in a boat and they're going to catch you. They're going to see you. Or wherever it is that you are, you're trying to be intimate. You're in an area where you're trying to be intimate somewhere out in nature. And um, I see a woman sitting a few feet away from you. I also see you're close to a waterfall. And someone is trying to make a decision if they should make love here or will they get caught. But just to let you know, if you're thinking about, okay, someone is saying, we can do it when this car, when this, this boat go past. See that boat down there? See the people in the boat? Now look up here. See the lady? Can you see her? Can you see the deer? So this could mean that this person wants to be out in nature with you. This this older person and told them to take you in nature and you and be intimate with you out there. But just realize there's a child somewhere watching. See the child up here? See the child? So before you take your clothes off, Taurus. You better look around because I feel like people is going to be watching you or they're going to catch you. And then when they catch you, <laughs> you may be like this. You see how he carrying her away? Trying to hurry up so nobody will see her. Might run to a, go into a cave or somewhere to hurry up where you think nobody can see you all of these cards flipped out and said it's possibilities so what I'm feeling instead of instead of being out to make love out in nature make the decision to be somewhere you can go in a um and don't 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 do this either. Don't do this either. Some of y'all are saying some of you are so into nature that you want to you want some people to see you. Okay? Some of you want people to see you having sex. That's your fetish. Okay? Some of you, if you can't have sex out in nature, is even thinking about just being somewhere and leaving your windows open. That's what this old man is telling this young guy. To be free. Give me more for Taurus. Give me more for Taurus. In this decision. Why is this decision here? 
that was already out there got me set. It's the shine card. Believe. You have to make a decision. You have to be committed and you have to believe that there's a possibilities out there. Um, yeah, this, this, this older man is talking to this child, talking to this younger person. He's giving him information. Um, okay. So this person could have a twin. They could have a brother that's behind them in their ear telling them what to do. An older brother. Where they should be taking the lead. Excuse me. They should be taking the lead of their life themselves. Okay. But this person is telling them how to sex you up and put you to sleep. They're telling them different ways to, let me see, let me see, what else is this person telling this person? What else are they telling them? What else are they telling them, spirit? What else are they telling them? Telling them to be strong. They're telling them um, this is a possible Leo. Um, they're telling them how to show strength when it comes to you. And when it's the sexual, they could be um, telling them to take them sex, them energy sex pills. And this is why you're going to sleep. They're not telling you. They're giving you, uh, he's taking those. Uh, Viag what they call Viagra's, rhinos, and the the the, the sex pills, the dick hardness they sell in, in the uh <laughs> dick hardness, dick hardness, dick hardness, dick hardness. What you put on me, some dick hardness? What you got in that drink, some dick hardness? Hmm. Dick hardness will put you here. This is what the dick hardness did. The hardness. The cardinals have you feeling all up in nature. Yeah, they filled you up. Oh, yeah, they filled you up. Look at that bubble. Oh, Taurus, look at that bubble. And then that could be a sperm bubble. They could have then got you pregnant. Or they're going to get you pregnant and carry you away and ask you to marry them. And this person, this older man, is, is coaching this guy. He's coaching him. Mm -hmm. He's being coached. Give me more spirit. He's being coached. That's going to be the, the title of the video. This person is being coached. But it doesn't seem like in a bad way because this person, they could be young, younger than you. And there's that other picture. So this this older man is is telling them, or older brother, older older sibling, is telling him how to put you to sleep. Give me more on this decision. Give me more on the decision. Give me more on the decision. Effort. And you see how the boy got the magic stick in his hand? I'm dead. Yeah. If 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 he's not telling him how to put you, he's he could be teeth. Oh. 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 Now it can change, Taurus. This could be some magic. See how the boy is holding the magic stick in his hand, the magic wand? A young boy here. A young boy here. 
a young man here and look at the girl on the horse. See the girl on the horse? He's teaching him to do magic to get her. And it could be with sex magic because this wand could represent the dick. Okay? And he holding his dick at you. Mm-hmm. Taking you on trips. He's teaching he's teaching him magic. Yeah, he's teaching him magic. This older man is teaching this young man magic. To how to to on magic how to entice you magically, sexually. So if 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 you've been having sex with this person, Taurus, for those of you that have been having sex with this person, and you've been with this person for a while, but now all of a sudden, after you have sex with them, you're falling, you, you're sleepy, they putting it down on you, it's because they're using magic. Either they're using magic or they're using those um, pills. Okay. And I see the effort is here, but if they're doing it, doing it magic, that's the wrong effort, you know. This person, this this older man is telling him how to how to be a leader when it comes to sex with you in a relationship. Okay, give me more why Taurus wasn't shining. Give me more on why Taurus wasn't shining. Oh, I know why you wasn't shining because this person was putting a magic stick on you, and all you did was go to sleep. And they did this because they didn't want you to, to transform. They, they try to take your butterflies away from you. They try to keep you in a cocoon and didn't want you to blossom. So what he did, this old man, he, he told this old man, I don't want her to get too big. She may get away from me. I don't want her to get away from me. So this old man told him, I'll, I'll teach you how to keep her. Okay, so that's what's going on, Taurus. Okay, and I'm going to stop the video right here. And if you don't believe me, here's the magic stick right here. Here's where they're going to put you in a bubble for commitment. He's telling this guy to trust. And remember, it's this old man with all of this wisdom. See all of this he got up under his robe? He's teaching him. He's teaching him everything, how to how to uh, be a family man, how to deal with animals. Uh, telling him to go slow. Uh, he's trying to give you a baby. Yeah. Mm hmm He's trying to give you a baby. He's taking the time. He's taking his time to give you a baby. Okay. So, Taurus, if this video resonated with you, please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Um, I'm not doing no personal readings at this time. But if you have any questions for me, just put them in the comments. And when I get to my comments... If you have a question, I can answer the question for you right then or pull a single card for you right when I see the question instead of doing the personal readings and I'll just put the answer in the comments for you if you like that. Okay, so if you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Please give me a like to help my channel rotate, to help my videos get out to help people because I'm transforming. I'm going through transformation and I want to help you go through transformation. We can go through it together, right, baby? Okay, peace out.